Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Culture in the United Republic of Tanzania, Dr. Suleiman Serrera, Deputy Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Culture, Arts and Sports in the United Republic of Tanzania, Mr. Adama Dombia, Technical Advisor of the Minister of Sports of Ivory Coast, Mr. Kragbe Philippe Michael, Chief of Staff for the Ministry of Sports in Ivory Coast, Mr. Bisa Kwame, Director of Law of the Ministry of Sports in Ivory Coast, Mr. Ali Maya Itembele, Acting Director of Sports Development at the Ministry of Culture, Arts and Sports, Ms. Neema Msita, CEO of the National Council, National Sports Council, Mohan, Commissioner of Sports, and News, Culture and Sports in Zanzibar, sports officers and government officials present here, all dignitaries, protocol observed. Greetings in the name of the United Republic of Tanzania. I thought we'd be taught. <laughs> First and foremost, I extend my to the Almighty for his grace and blessings, which have gathered us here today for this special and historic occasion. On behalf of the government of United Republic of Tanzania, I warmly welcome you all to Dar es Salaam, especially here at Benjamin William Mkapa Stadium. I bring warm greetings from Her Excellency Dr. Samia Sulu Hassan, President of the United <coughs> Republic of Tanzania, who is aware of your visit. Allow me to extend my personal greetings to you, Honorable Ajay Silas Match, Minister of Sports in Ivory Coast, and your esteemed team for your participation in this significant event for sports development in both Tanzania and Ivory Coast. Honorable Minister, on behalf of Dr. Damaris Numbaro, the Minister of Culture, Arts and Sports, I express sincere appreciation to the delegation from Ivory Coast for graciously accepting our invitation and traveling from Ivory Coast to Tanzania for this official visit. Although Dr. Ndubaro could not be here today due to another official engagement, he is aware and informed of the proceedings. Our gathering today stems uh, from the fruitful collaboration initiated during AFCON 2024, where we had the, uh, the privilege to attend the event in Ivory Coast. Through discussions and meetings, we recognized the importance of formalizing our cooperation in the sports industry for the mutual benefit of both our nations. Dear college, this signify uh, a milestone following alongside Kenya and Uganda to host AFCON 2027. This memorandum of understanding will enable Tanzania to leverage and in, uh, the invaluable experience of Ivory Coast, who have demonstrated remarkable achievement as host of AFCON 2024. Rather than seeking consultation from first world countries, Tanzania aims to learn from our Ivorian counterparts for the benefits of our nation. As we embark on this collaborative journey, let us remember that each of us possesses unique gifts and destinies waiting to unfold. By sharing experiences and passions, we paint uh, the canvas of our future. Let us be the artists who forge our destiny, guided by the wisdom of our elders in Ivory Coast. Tanzania and Ivory Coast have opportunity to nurture young talents and make a positive impact on the global stage. Athletes, coaches, and other stakeholders in, in the sports industry stand to benefit from the collaboration windows today. Let us heed Rafaldo Emerson's words, do not go where the path may lead, go instead where the path, where there is no path and leave a trail. May this memorandum of understanding be our tool to blaze new trails and shape our destiny. Today marks the beginning of our partnership brimming with opportunities and through our collective efforts, we can unlock the full potential 
of our sports industries and contribute to the social economic development of our nations. Honorable Minister and esteemed participants, this event underscores the commitment of our government to fostering collaboration and opening doors for development in various sectors, including sports and culture. The Memorandum of Understanding we are signing today reaffirms our shared vision for progress and uh, cooperation. As you prepare to depart for Ivory Coast later this uh, afternoon, I wish you a safe and pleasant journey back home. Furthermore, let me reiterate our commitment to maintaining close communication and collaboration between our nations. We look forward to frequent exchange and continued cooperation in the sports industry and beyond. Once again, I thank you all for participation in this uh, significant event and for your attention. Thank you for your attention. Uh, Mr. Uh, Honorable Minister, now that I take this opportunity to welcome you to take on uh, this event.